Hello, my name is Richard Bateson and I wanted to introduce you to my new book, Financial Derivative Investments, an introduction to structured products. Um, over the last 15 years there's been considerable um, technological development in derivatives and this has led to great innovation in the structured product market. In this book I've, I've laid out, provided an overview of the structured products that have been developed over the last 15 years and a guide to how to understand them for investors. I think the book has really been designed for financial professionals and students, perhaps in finance, and I think that instead of having a book which is uh, focusing, as many derivatives books do, on the mathematical finance of de derivatives, I've really um, pushed the dreary mathematics to the back of the book, whilst and instead concentrated on the practical applications of derivatives technology. So in the book there is over 60 examples of actual uh, transactions and some of these transactions have been very good transactions for investors, others have been complete disasters and it's interesting to see the scope of the transactions and any transactions that you'll see today will probably be uh, derived from these basic set of transactions. So in the book I discuss everything from derivatives based on equities and single stock equities, um, indices, um, also in equities we have things like basket and correlation products, for example the SOC gen range of uh, mountain range of products which were quite co complicated correlation products. Uh, we cover FX and uh, interest rate products, for example interest rate structured notes, uh, accrual notes, things like this and Bermudan structures and we have also credit products which are for example, um, credit link notes, uh, products based on credit default swaps, uh, first to default baskets, and things like CDOs. In CDOs, I discuss things like uh, cash CDOs, synthetic CDOs, and even the um, CDO squared structure, which came out just before the uh, credit crisis. Also, I discuss things like hybrids and fund options. So really, there's a big overview of different types of structured products, which I think uh, readers will find interesting and I've really emphasized the uh, practical aspects of these and how they're actually traded and structured. Um, also to make it a bit more interesting I've included some anecdotes of my own experience of these, these products and how really um, they've been uh, applied and marketed to investors and I think that will give readers, particularly those which aren't involved in the financial markets, a good idea of how these markets operate and the players involved. Anyway, I hope uh, the readers find the book interesting and I hope that you learn something from it. So, thank you.